Okay, listen, you guys might be tired of hearing about it. I've made several community posts about it at this point, but I want to talk about it in the video form to get more people connected into this situation and talk about what I've found. For those wondering, this is going to be my last time talking about it. I don't want to be that guy that's like whining on YouTube about YouTube. You get what I'm saying? But this has developed into the point where it's like a drama. Now, you get what I'm saying? It seems like the commentary community is under attack. Myself, along with other creators, have been hit hard without reason. Tom Dark was hit really badly and got a strike on his channel for supposedly harmful content. Hello, at Team YouTube, I've appealed the policy decision and after review, I still have a strike on my channel. This decision has been made in error. There is no content encouraging harmful or dangerous acts in my video. All content within this video is already available on YouTube, which is why this is so frustrating. Please review this decision, reinstate my video, and reverse this strike. YouTube actually like doubles down and says, update. Unfortunately, our policy team confirmed that your video will not be reinstated. We understand this wasn't the outcome you were hoping for, but please review our policy on harmful and dangerous content to avoid this in the future. This doesn't make any sense. All content shown in the video is already available on YouTube as seen in this video, which I'm gonna have to blur out because the, uh, something with links, I don't know. I was reviewing the guidelines again. I simply included footage from this video that has 12 million views and I'm somehow being penalized for it. How is this fair or reasonable? And since then, they have stopped responding and essentially have been ignoring him. Dumpy was also pretty hit hard. They age restricted a part of his video for showing Courage the Cowardly Dog and saying it was nudity. After speaking with three different Team YouTube employees via the live chat, I've been told the final decision and we can't review the video again. This is absolutely ridiculous. Below you will find what classifies as nudity and deserves to be age restricted. Not gonna show it, but it's a clip of Nick A30. I'm trying to be as safe as I can about this, okay? Augie RFC got hit on a seven year old unlisted gaming stream with less than a hundred views. Hey, Team YouTube, why was a seven year old gaming stream that had less than a hundred views randomly just taken down for hate speech when no such violation occurred? And why was my appeal instantly rejected? Obviously a mistake, please investigate. He has an issue with the instant like rejection because the reviews are supposed to be human reviews and there's no way they went through a stream instantly. After thorough review from our policy team, unfortunately your video won't be reinstated. We understand this wasn't the outcome you were hoping for, but please review our policy policy on hate speech to avoid this in the future. It's like copy and paste, dude. And for me personally, I've been hit pretty hard with demonetization. Every single video of mine now is automatically flagged by YouTube and they will tell me why. Personally, most of my videos get reinstated after the fact. Because of that, I lost out on all the initial revenue from the new stuff. You get what I'm saying? And for once that they double down on, their reasoning is like, it's terrible. My more recent tipster video, which I'm not going to show here because again, I don't want to give them any reason for this to be flagged. But one of the reasons they gave was the F word used in the title or thumbnail. If you go back and look, it's not there. <laughs> I'm kind of just winging this right now, but quickly pulling up the transcript here, there isn't a single mention of any curse words throughout the entirety of the video. I want to hope this is some kind of glitch, but I don't think it is. It seems like YouTube is trying to shut down commentary. It blows my mind that we are the people calling out these issues, and instead of solving the issues that we talk about, they target the ones making it known that this is happening. I won't give up, I'm still here, and I will be here for a long time, so be sure to have your notifications on because YouTube might start suppressing us more and more. Anyway, Anyways, I'm out. And thank you to channel members Sergeant Frost, Lucian, Phoenix Ace, AUE, Jay Marie, Contrapazani, and Shadow Overflow AI. You guys are genuinely what keeps this going.